Hey guys, it's Ashley, 3R Sales and Service. We're taking a look at our 14-foot tandem axle trailer package today. This features a 3,500 PSI, 10 gallon a minute cold water washer that has the option of spraying at 10 gallon a minute or we have a two gun system on it as well so you can use it at five gallon to each gun. And then we've got the 10 gallon gas engine soft wash system on here too. So we'll go ahead, take a look around and show you all the components on it. So starting up front here, We've got the uh, GX800 Honda engine that has the fuel injection, electric start, and then we've got a big T-Series general pump on here as well. Behind the pressure washer, we've got a six gallon fuel tank and the battery that powers the electric start. To the other side, we've got three 16 gallon tanks and these tanks will hold antifreeze. It'll hold soap for the downstream soap injection through your pressure washer and it holds the surfactant uh, that goes to the soft wash system. The other side, we have the gas engine soft wash. This has the Honda GX200 engine and the AR45 diaphragm pump. And this is hooked up to the proportioner system right next to it with the, uh, the three valve manifold. There's actually a fourth valve available on there if you wanted to add another soap or different type of surfactant. So this is the water line. We've got the surfactant line and then we've got the SH line. And down below here, it's a little hard to see, but there is a rinse line as well for this SH so that you can keep that, uh, those valves nice and clear. We do keep a filter going into that water line just so you don't get any junk from your tank stuck into the, uh, the soft wash system. This is a 325 gallon tank, which we've got a two inch drain attached to as well. Keep these off to the side for hand washing and bucket filling. And of course those two inch drains, they move a lot of water out of there pretty quickly. So over to the hose reels, we've got four 18 inch electric hose reels. Uh, these first two here are for the pressure washer system. So up top, we've got the yellow hose. There's 200 feet of three eighths hose here. This is gonna um, be your primary reel for the pressure washer. And then down below is your secondary reel. So how it works is, we equip these with two high pressure, I'm sorry, high pressure ball valves. So you can use this as 10 gallon a minute. You just shut this one off, or you can use both of them at five gallon a minute and open up both of those valves. You can also use it to exchange your wand for your surface cleaner uh, for those aspects as well. Um, but you'll be given two sets of nozzles for 10 gallon a minute and five gallon a minute so that you can use the system either way. If you only wanted to use it as five gallon a minute, you can just bypass all that extra water to your tank. So there's a lot of options with these two gun systems. And then the next set of reels that we have here are, uh, we have a 300 foot of half inch hose for the soft wash system. And then we've got 200 feet of the three quarter inch hose for your incoming line to fill your water tank. And of course with that water tank, we have a float valve in there. So it automatically shuts the water off whenever it's full and then starts filling again. Whenever it, uh, whenever it pulls water through either of these systems. That way you're always working with a full tank and you don't have to monitor it to make sure to see if it's overflowing or anything. And then we'll move around the other side here. Give you a better look. We've got a five foot toolbox here. Opens real nicely. Um, it's got shocks and everything that'll hold it up. We have a 50 gallon uh, SH tank that runs over to the soft wash system. And then of course our water tank not only feeds the pressure washer, but it feeds the soft wash system as well. So uh, last but not least, we have the ladder rack. It's uh, always nice to be able to have somewhere where you can store any of those longer items like extension poles or ladders or whatnot, whatever you need. Um, and then otherwise we have, I mean, the benefit of this trailer, uh, the main benefit of course, is that it's all aluminum. So it has the aluminum frame and it's also got the aluminum flooring and everybody knows how corrosive bleach or SH is on, uh, on their trailers. Um, it's, we've seen it eat through the wood floors before. That's why we use this protective flooring on our wood trailers. Um, but it's a huge priority to get something that's corrosion resistant for these systems. But so not only is it functional, but they look nice as well. But if you have any questions, just give us a call. Thanks.